camera, I know, but better quality. It's worth it. <sighs> here we go. It's all downhill from here. Big episode 3-0, number 30. 30, we have to make sure that there's no errors because someone will not want to edit this out. Exactly, because I have a lot of editing to do. But most importantly, are you done? No, never. <laughs> We have our first guest. It's a 90-year-old. Her name is Shannon, and she is 90. <laughs> Thanks for having me on your podcast, guys. Talking to the mic. Don't be yeah, weird. Oh, don't be I forget. Sorry. Thanks for having me. Remember first when guest. you complain about yeah. our volume? Feel special. You should. I can't wait to watch this back and then criticize Shannon for everything she I know. did. <laughs> Probably, but I don't do this all the time, so. Yeah, yeah one so and done. You're good at judging. Now let's see. Now let's see how you perform. Yeah, it's because I watch done. all the time, unlike some other people. Actually, you don't because you asked, how do, where do we sit? How do we sit? Yeah. No, I just thought you guys sat at like the table or something. I was thinking I about doing sure. that for this one. Because you guys don't see like the bo- I don't see the bottom. Exactly. So well, yeah, you're not We're so levitating. True. We float. Or ghosts, guess so. actually. Yeah. Float like a butterfly, sting like a bee, okay. or a hemorrhoid. Never again. Don't do that. What? what All right. So, yeah, that? we got our first guest on episode 30. It is Shannon. Your um, former ex-girlfriend. Ex-fiance, ex-girlfriend. So, soon to His be wife. ex-wife. <laughs> <laughs> Can't so, wait for that to happen. Yeah. No, no she just that will me be for fair. my money. He'll be sleeping on that couch the yeah, whole time. Yeah, you're welcome. No, yeah. I got my own house. He always calls it his house, but it's our house. Like, I don't pay bills. I just did a lot of the renovations, and you just and watched me do it. And she lovingly watched you and supervised. Yeah. She, she wasn't even there half the time. That's true, because I was there, uh, you know, towards the end. and uh, You weren't you, there at all. You were there one time. Uh, yeah, she, he was there maybe two times. Like three, two times. Okay, yeah, but let's see. Baseboards, the worst. Bringing in that fridge, wanted to toaster bath. Okay. <laughs> The worst of times. Yeah. So, not the worst of worst, but some of the worst. Yeah. Some of the worst bad stuff. But, but I remember she got mad at me because mm-hmm. I said the I said the F word out of frustration. And she goes, what hey. Word? Frank? Francesco? I said, yeah. I said, Frank. Francesco. She, go, she goes, hey, we don't say that word. I'm like, in the middle of me installing the flooring, we got baseboards going, just everything going wrong at, at the time. <laughs> She's just like, hey, No. It's like my I'm dealing with like all dog. the headaches and everything, and then she's just like because I get no. yelled at for saying the f word. Ooh. Yeah, you say it casually like a pirate. I don't <laughs> like a little <laughs> not all the time. Like a little sailor, not all the time. So, but anyway, Shannon, yeah. we have questions that we want to ask you. But for, I'll do the fun one first. Yikes. Tell us about how you met my best friend. Um. So the first time that desperate. I had ever went to what? Oh, I was just saying you were desperate. You're fine. Not at all. Clearly First time settled. I had ever went to Mexican Village, um, I saw him and I thought he was cute. And by the end of my blue margarita, I had left my number on the receipt. And apparently he had already knew who I was because we went to high school together. Yes, as I'm made aware, you bullied him in high school. I did. Don't put I, that in the internet. I, I had did to eat not lunch bully in Christian. The bathroom because no. she picked on me. And Christian her just and her makes gang this. Of no, Christian just makes this dramatic story. I did not bully him at all. We actually but did not did talk. But he did eat lunch. In I'm not bathroom. sure if that's true because we I, never talked in high school. Okay, that's it is because you bullied me no, into I, the bathroom. How can I bully you when I never talked to you? In You're high like, school? hey, loser, hey, nerd, hey, not dweeb, at all. Hey, nope. nerd, dirt, nerd, dweeb, not at all. Yeah, he texted Didn't me. Happen. He's like, this one blonde made me cry. I'm I in wasn't the even blonde. I'm in eating high peanut butter. This and one jelly. girl. She walked around with like sweatpants and her backpack on, but she like walked like the hunchback, so it would be like. No, I didn't. I only do that now. <laughs> Her posture's gotten worse. Yeah. yeah wait is. till she's 90, actually. Yeah. She's just internally All right, internally continue with 90. how you met yes. me. Go so, ahead. Go ahead. So wait, was uh, it so, a mucho or a... No, it was just a regular. Wow. I can't even drink a mucho now. I'm such a lightweight, which is good. You're just that attractive. Cheap date. So <laughs> left my number at the end of the blue margarita, yeah. and then a whole day had passed, and I was at work, and I was telling one of the girls I work with, I was like, I can never go back to this restaurant because this kid never texts me back. That's always my first thought. If I ever leave a number, I'm like, man, yeah. am I going to go back there? Really? So how does nervous. So, let's, so you made her wait a day and a half? <laughs> yeah. Was that the initial strat, or were you going to make her wait longer? Well, every time I would text people, like, a little while after they gave me a number or I just met them, I'm I'm all of a sudden too eager and all of a sudden they, they want nothing to do with it. So I decided to delay it. But nice. I guess delaying it is bad, too. It's like, it's a lose, I guess lose. it wasn't a bad thing. It's a lose-lose world for guys out there. No, yeah, I guess really I was tough. just like waiting a little bit 
Like, I hope it, I wish it would have been like closer. You what know, would it, so like 12 it was hours? Like, I'm my way home. So it was like 4 30 or 5 o'clock. And I was like, who is texting me? And you're like, oh my gosh, I give out my number all the time. No, yeah. I, no you're like, much. hey, it's it's the guy from yesterday. You're like, which one? <laughs> I was yeah, at which one? This I had one for margarita. Lunch, this one for lunch. This one for happy hour. This one for dinner. And then I went somewhere else for a late night, night snack. So who is it? Please specify. Yeah. But so. that's cool. So then you guys started dating for how long? Um, we dated for... A little over a year. Yeah, a little over a year with a little break in between. Yeah, we don't have to go over that part. That I was, just... I didn't... Was I time. wasn't going yeah. to. Yeah, you yeah, brought yeah. it up. And then we well, got I mean, back together for two months. Then I proposed. Yep. And yeah. And we were engaged for a year and a, a half. A year and a half. And then got married 2020. Yeah. I was the best man. Best speech ever. Yep. And, uh, oh, why don't you guys tell them about your wedding? Because I don't think we've ever mentioned it in the pod. I don't think so. What about our wedding? Um, so we, All of it. The fact that I lost a lot of money? Yep. Yeah, we did. Oh, that one. Oh, yeah, yeah. that part. And so, how you guys went through f- three venues, yeah. essentially. We had one venue. One, two, and yeah, And no one had gave us any, like, wedding advice and to just not put... No one said don't pay it all off at yeah, once. Yeah, no one said just put the deposit down. No one, like, nobody, nobody. Because none of our friends were really, like... Married, married, yeah, like not a lot of them. I think it so, was like what Josh and maybe Jordan. That was it. That was married so far at that point. Yeah, well, and then yeah, my and girlfriends. I, it was like Kim, Kara and Kim, Kim. and, they didn't and help you Alyssa out? maybe too. Yeah, Alyssa. Yeah, but like yeah. I don't know. We just never really talked about that stuff. Money is like a you know. A they weird, don't care. They, yeah. yeah so racks. anyway, we booked a venue. Yeah. I paid paid it off because I don't like having I hate debt, debt. outstanding debt like yeah. that. Um, and then we were going fine, and then. Next thing you know, we learned that they filed Chapter 7 bankruptcy. Um, I think I got an email. Yeah. An e- no, really, <laughs> hey, an by email. The way. And I was like, yeah, I called him email. right away, and I was like, hey, you got to read this over because I'm in traffic. Like, I think our venue just went bankrupt. Yeah. So the venue, when you, venue went bankrupt. We yep. were initially in Auburn Hills, and then there was another one in Southfield. So same company. Yeah, yeah, same exact company. They're like, hey, we'll, what we'll do is we'll – We'll just transfer it over. We'll, we have your date available. We're going to do it here. I'm like, okay. Um, hesitant at the time. I'm just like, okay, so what's it looking like? I mean, the lease agreement there. I mean, do you think you're going? Like, no, no, no. We, Our lease agreement just renewed. We're good for the next, we're good for the next five years. Um, you know, we're, we're still taking deposits. We're still taking, you know, reservations and stuff. Everything's fine. So we ended up booking through them. We got the full money transferred over. Nothing. No no problems. We talked to our caterers and stuff. They were like, oh, yeah, no big deal. So they transferred everything And we over. were able to still keep our date, which was nice. Yeah. yeah everything that's everything that was a big thing for me. Over. We just, yeah. It was just like pretending we booked at Southfield initially. And then one night, and then I get a Facebook. call. It, yeah. No, I get a call from my friend saying that her friend saw on the news that that venue went bankrupt. And so... The whole time, these venues did not call like their customers or Quick anything to tell the them. Yeah. yeah. So we ended up finding out on Facebook pretty much because mm-hmm. that's when it went through. And someone goes, they just took my son's deposit for his 21st birthday the day before. They were still collecting that money. money. So, so it was that morning. So. Even though they knew they were going bankrupt. So Friday morning, they just took it like a $2,200 deposit. Jeez. And then Friday at like 5 o'clock or 7 o'clock. They shut their doors. So I didn't, I got some money back, but I didn't get it all back. Luckily, I was able to file some credit card And they said that the owner of like that company like fled the country. Like he was out. out. His name's Bill with one L. So that's how you know it's a problem. Yeah. It's like B-I-L. Yeah. His parents were trying to do him a solid and they did not. Yeah. He liquidated pretty his company. Then we had to settle with what venue had left of our date because that date was pretty important to us. Right. Um, And I don't know. 10, 20, 4, 20. Yeah. Yeah. And, and then next thing you know, we went there. You know, they gave us a really good deal on everything. We did a food tasting. Everything was really good. Yeah. And then day the of food. the wedding, food turned out to be trash. Couldn't get a hold of the owner because a lot of stuff was not happening the way it was planned. Mm. The salad was spicy because they put way too much <laughs> pepper Dude, it in it. Dude, it reminded me some, of Texas Roadhouse. Yeah. And some, wait, you didn't even eat, the, did you? The salad I was super pepper. <laughs> yeah, the salad was spicy. The pasta, that. the sauce was burnt. And they loaded it with Parmesan cheese to mask it. Some people, I guess, were getting raw chicken. Yeah. Um, mm, I did order medium raw. They, medium rare. Medium the raw. The donut wall 
had a bunch of pegs missing out of it. So there was just like they random didn't know that. They told us that they were doing Blake's Donuts, but they ended up being um, Entenmann's. Yeah. yeah, from the store. <laughs> yeah, they were told yeah. they were going to get cider and donuts, give yeah. us a late night snack. Apparently, the banana foster was hidden in the bathroom and they were doing it there. Oh, wow. Not, not really. It was off to the side, but I, no one even knew about it. It was I, there and gone. It was, just, it was just chaos and whatever. It was done and over with and that was about it. Yeah, it was, it was a... Fun of events. That's just it's yeah. it's only events. been up from there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. We'll Everything else was good though with our wedding besides COVID and people not wanting to come. But yeah, you know. I mean, I thought it turned out nice. I thought it was really like private. Well, we invited we invited like 170 people and no, almost probably, 200. Yeah, was, almost 200 people yeah. and 95 showed. Yeah, something, something like that. that. Yeah. So huge, okay. uh, huge cutoff. It's okay. <laughs> but whatever. What else? Oh. So uh, where we let's go Randall. back on to more on Shannon. So oh. Shannon, yeah, um, Shannon, back dysplasia, hip dysplasia, knee dysplasia, shoulder dysplasia. Um, Not just, at all. Just a lot of dysplasia. Not at all. What's it like wait, being Shepard. 90 years wait, old living with these Do you even dysplasia? know what dysplasia means? Yeah, it's not there. It's I don't think that's... Okay, listen, just because you think you know it all because you do some type of medicine stuff doesn't mean anything. Oh, yeah, what do you do? Yeah, what do you do I'm for a living? medical assistant, a medical scribe with a lot of medical knowledge. Pretty much a doctor without a degree. Without I should have went to PA school when I was younger. You should have. You're still young. Should have, would have, could have. Pretend I'm talking still in here. What are you doing? Where are you make, going? I got to make sure the camera's recording. Oh, great. Good news it is. Okay. All right, so what was your question? Yeah, yeah, all these problems that you have as I a 90-year-old. I don't have a lot of problems. How do you go through it? I don't have a lot Tim of problems. I'm not going to put TMJ? my medical history on the internet. Why? What's so- HIPAA? <laughs> I'm not gonna let all your people know. What's it like your knowing your 10k you a, subscribers know about my medical history? Wow. What's it like knowing you had a full hip replacement? I did not have a full hip replacement. You had what? One surgery? Yeah, I had one surgery. I had a you labrum, had two shoulder surgery. Labral yeah, tears. Yeah. Broken yeah. people. What's funny is we both had labral tears in our joints. It, that's how you knew it was, it was you were each other's people. No, mm-hmm. <laughs> that's not how. Christian, what was your first impression when you met Shannon? Desperate. Can you tw- stop. She Can threw you be 20 serious? Do- she threw twenty dollars on the tip and was like, "All right, call me." I'm like, "Yeah, all right." She, he's like, "If it would have been nineteen, no dice." Yeah, but the twenty, 20 spot. 20 right. Spot. Oh, you're welcome. Sorry for giving you an extra, whatever tip. Yeah. A nice tip. Well, now your his money's your money, and your yeah. money's his money. Not really. That's not what he says. He says my money is my money, and my money is my money. That's what he says. That's why we have joint accounts. Yeah, that's what he says. Because you lack joints. Yeah. Nice, nice, full circle. Yeah. Anyway, Shannon, you and I first met on a cruise. You remember that? Yes, on Woodward. Yeah. Yep. We mm-hmm. Christian, you texted me like, were we supposed to cruise at first? And you're like, hey, Shannon's coming. Is that no, happened? I don't think so. Or I think we us? were. I don't remember what we did, but I just know I picked you up. We were. I think. We, oh, we went to um. Uh, Johnny Black's or not Johnny Black's, um, Bar Louie. Did we? Yeah, because we were at Bar Louie. I, I remember went to. That day. Yeah, yeah. I only I remember, remember us that. cruising. Yeah, I only remember in the car. No, it I was remember. like a movie where we forgot everything and then we were just no, like we in met, the car. I think Anthony and Bree. Did we? Why didn't they go with the sun too? Then why didn't they? Because cruise they with drew us? Se- they drove separately. I don't don't forget, Bree had like the curfews and stuff like that. Oh too. yeah. So no, it was we that. went to Bar Louie and everything, mm-hmm. and then we cruised. We, we ended up cruising. Yeah, we did. Shannon and I bonded over Eminem, not the candy. No. Because we don't like the same M&M's. Nope. Not at all. Peanut M&M's are supreme. Fudge brownie. I, wait, did the, you try uh, those coffee ones? Yeah, they're awful. Yeah, They're gross. disgusting. Anything they've got the caramel texture. Bad. The caramel M&M's are awful, too, because they've got this weird, hard, sticky texture. It's disgusting. Speaking of M&M's, what is your favorite? Um, I like the pretzel ones. Those are good. The pretzel Ooh, and fudge brownie. Fire. Okay. Now Shane and I have more. No, no. What about you? What, what's your M M&M? and M? Peanut M and M's. Peanut, peanut butter. I like the crispy ones. Those are good. I do like pretzels. Okay, no, from pretzel's time to superior. time. Pretzels superior. I do like the caramel ones. So you like the what's caramel your, ones? What's your guys' favorite flavor of M and M? We didn't we just peanut, talk about this? Peanut. No, are you talking peanut about the butter? color? Yeah, the color. blue. I eat the blue first. <laughs> <laughs> the color. I think yeah. that's just part of my OCD. They're all the same. They're all the same. Yeah. Yeah. but like you have to like eat the certain ones first. What I, do you eat first? I don't like the brown ones, actually. Either do I. I separate the brown. 
I but, just like I think I don't know why what it, it's just an unas- it's an unappealing color. I like loud just, colors. You don't Same with them. like Skittles. I get rid of the I'll, purple I'll ones. Eat them, Actually, I don't like, like red. I don't like a lot of the red ones. Mm, that's fair. But I haven't red M and M's are fine. I'm fine with red M and M's. Because all the colors taste the same. Like, just eat them. <laughs> I don't like the brown M and M's. When it comes to it's Skittles, I really I really don't do the the purple M and M or the purple Skittles, and I don't really care for the red M- Skittles. I think the purple Skittles. No, that's grape. I like all Skittles, I think. I don't like the orange ones. I'm not an orange. You don't like food. orange anything. The, yeah, green, I don't like orange anything. the green might be my only sus one. Green, it constantly changes from apple to lime, and it goes back and forth way too many times. There's not. There's not. There's For just Skittles? Food dye. It's just food dye. I, well, no, yeah, I think but Skittles no, they are, change the flavor. Yeah, the flavor inside he's talking about. Like, not the oh, outside. Oh, yeah, yeah. Because Skittles are flavored. Yeah. How do you taste the rainbow? They all uh, they all taste the same. They do. No, they don't. Yes, they yeah, do. they do. They're all the same, but they sit there. And it's all the same. It's just no. Oh, have you had like the the like the extra flavored ones, like the berry or like the all red? Okay, like, those yeah. are different. The berry ones are different flavored. You're telling me a, the yellow one tastes the same as the red one? Yes. I don't think so. We yes. should we should try that. We will do that. Yeah. We'll do a skittle. Comment one. down below. Do all skittles taste the same? Because I think no. they do. They don't. 100%. Better. Go to the store right now and go get some skittles. I'll be right back. You guys keep podcasting without me. Okay. And then, what was the next question I had? Okay, okay. Shannon. So, this is a deep question. I feel like I'm on deal or no deal. Yep. Okay. Here we go. Why do you hate movies? Ugh. And what, aka, why do you hate my best friend? Because he loves movies. <laughs> he does love movies. And Danny, he hates I, can't I can't even go to a movie theater because she doesn't ever want to go. She we want to do a nice Oppenheimer and Barbie double feature. She won't okay. go. Shannon won't go. Um, I don't like to sit at the movie theater because I get fidgety. I get too fidgety and then he gets so mad at me because I'm fidgety. He's like, stop moving so much. You're making too much noise. Yeah, she's like this. <laughs> she's like this in that movie okay, chair. And not I'm like, my Come arms. on. Not my arms. Just my legs. Just my legs get of, restless. And then, or then she'll start talking to me. How much longer does this have? No, I'm like, do you know who that is? What's happening? That's like a that's got to be a woman thing because my mom <laughs> does it all the time. She's like, Francesca, what's going on? I'm like, Mom, we're literally watching this for the first time together. I don't know. She's um, like, why do you think he's doing that? I'm like, Mom, I'm sure they explain it. Don't talk about mom like that. Um, oh, no. So that I don't really have a long attention span, so that's why I like Clearly. TV shows better because the TV show like ends, like the episode ends. Even, no, she doesn't even like TV shows because she doesn't want to watch anything on TV ever I like unless reality it's TV. reality TV. Yeah. It's, oh my gosh, it's only reality TV reality for her, TV. and it sucks. Yeah. The only like, reality. Hey, let's watch this. No, let's watch this. No, no. I don't want to watch vampires. I don't want to watch horror. I don't want to watch action, action. comedy, drama, no, romantic like, comedies. She doesn't want to watch anything. No, I oh. like comedies, romantic comedies, and whatever. I had to watch 15 minutes of ant-man 3 because we couldn't watch what we wanted to watch right. and then shannon was out like five minutes about? In. the yeah. last time we were at your house i keep asking her hey let's watch nefarious because I don't oh, watch yeah, it. She she it's watch a suspenseful it. movie it's not a horror movie no. I mean, yeah, it's just I don't a thriller. Watch it. she's like nope don't want to watch it. Okay. Wanna you want to watch, watch extraction too? Nope. It's action. Don't want to watch that. If you want to watch it this, doesn't nope. catch my like doesn't thrill me. Why am I going to watch it if it doesn't thrill me? Because you don't let it thrill you. No, I don't like you're it. You're just like, you're just I'm like. I'm just going to be on my phone the whole you're time. You're closed minded. So, you're no, I'm mi- not. When it comes to like TV and movies, you're very no. closed minded. No, I'm not. Yeah, you're like, if it's reality you, TV, you I'll watch it. You don't want to watch like Avengers or nothing. It's too long. It's like three hours. All movies are long. No, if it's over two hours, I'm out. So you watch kids' movies? Only kids' movies are less than two hours. <laughs> That's why I don't watch movies. She watches the Santa. I but like she'll rom-coms. Watch everything when it comes to Christmas. Yeah, I love Christmas Dude, movies. Hallmark movies? No, no, no. I'm not a Hallmark. I'm not wow, like a that's surprising. like a corny person. Yeah, I'm not corny. Well, you're gonna go at my mom like that? No, yeah. Dude, all moms mom, like Hallmark movies. My mom do. loves Hallmark movies too. Do. Does Nancy like Hallmark movies? Probably. Um, yeah, she, I think she's been starting to watch them. I think she was watching a little bit of the Hallmark Christmas last year. Oh, okay. so I think that was like her first year actually, like watching it, watching it. They're just it, so. brutal. They're just all the same. It's That's why I literally can't watch all the it. same. Well, I'm they just all... a city girl moving to a small town. Yeah, or just for a little bit. Everybody knows yeah. everybody here. Yeah. Don the mailman knows Cindy over mm. at the cookie shop. Cindy knows Don in the mailroom. And they're mail just so room. corny. Like all the people in there are corny. I know. They're like, I can't. You're just like love is. A I line can't. I just love real. drama, so that's why I like reality TV. Yeah, like other people's drama, not my drama. I just Jersey like to know Shore the is the only acceptable reality TV. 
Ju- she was watching Star. Too Hot to Handle last yeah, night. Yeah, Too Hot so. to Handle's got a new season. Uh, Vanderpump Rules finished all ten seasons. Uh, isn't that the one where the people are like really weird and from Texas? No, they're from uh, California. Yeah. Is no. that the guy who got arrested? There's a, no. Jack's got arrested a lot. Yeah, Christy. but no, it's not like a crazy, like, on the beach, like, it's not like that. Like, mm-hmm. Floribama Shore, or whatever that is. Floribama yeah, that was Shore. like a wannabe Jersey Not that. Shore. Yeah, yeah, no, it's not like that. No, they, like, work at a restaurant. They've got, like, drama. And I, I've wor- we worked at a restaurant. Hell, yeah. Yeah, There's Mexican Village there. should have their own reality show. We I'm all worked at Mexican could. Village, by the way. Oh, yeah, yeah, we're all alumni. Yeah. You should all, you both should come back, and then we can all work together as well. Well, Nancy tries to get me to host all the time, and I hate hosting. I, it's one of the most boring things. It's not boring. People are mean. Oh, yeah. I just, like... I And have, I like, get no anxiety filter. if, like, people are looking at you, and I'm like, I don't got nowhere to say you. You can't sit down. They just sat yeah. down. I don't know what else to do. Yeah, I'm not really sure what to do. It is what it is. Go but... eat your food outside. All right, right we got home. we got about five minutes left, so let's... That's um, it? Yeah. We're just, we're just vibing. We're just going strong. Let's, um... <laughs> there are 20 to 20. You guys didn't minutes. even do your... The what? Topic. I, yeah, well, we're going to do that right now. Huh? That's what I said. I mean, we had about five five minutes left, so let's uh, touch on what we want to touch on. Um, initially, we were going to have this in front of us, and we were actually going to eat it. I never wanted to. But we're not going <laughs> to no? do that anymore. Uh-uh. So we're actually going to talk about um, food. Food. But hot, ver- hot versus cold. Is it better eating it warm, or is it better eating it cold, and why? Mm. So um, the most popular, pizza. Pizza. Where do we stand? Is it should we be eating hot or cold? You start with me first. Yeah, we'll yeah, start with on. you. Okay, first day definitely hot. When you first get it, second day cold is good, but like maybe lukewarm. No. What after after cold like fridge cold fridge or like cold. room temperature? Because like room cold. temperature is like perfect. Room temperature is not bad, but like okay, I would put room temperature over fridge. Yeah, for sure. But like yeah, if you're getting if I'm ordering a pizza like. I guess it's a different scenario. Like, if I eat, have leftover pizza... We're just talking cheese and pep, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll okay. keep it simple. Oh, barbecue chicken's elite no matter which way you uh, eat Hawaiian it. Hawaiian pizza elite no matter which way you eat it. Because, no, Hawaiian's a perfect breakfast because you got your fruit. You got... He, he, he's so um, adamant about yeah, it. Every he debates time, me this every you got time. Your ham. It's so good. And your carbs. Yeah. But, anyway. Um, pizza, hot? No. Like, you know, all rather, hot when you get it, like... I'd rather eat it cold. So you yeah. would rather get your pizza delivered to you cold? No, I want it I want it delivered hot. Okay, so I, the second I'll day. I'll let it sit. I'll let it sit before so, yeah, I let's eat it. We'll go leftover day. So it's your leftover yeah. day. Yeah. You get it. You're, you had the pizza the night before. You want it cold. I actually want the crust to be a little bit warm so it's softer. Everything else can be cold. How yeah, because it's really hard Easy, to eat. Because I'll just throw it in the microwave for 10 seconds and I'm good to and go. Compromise. I hate microwaving food at all. Any food. That's why you don't have a microwave. I do actually have a microwave. I don't have a microwave. But the oven takes too long. Yeah. No, I mean, it's pizza's good. I like pizza cold. I mean, yeah. if I have to choose, I'm going to take pizza day after. cold. Yeah. yeah, pizza's cold. I ate cold pizza yesterday. 100%. Yeah. All right, next. Wings. Um, bone hot. in or boneless? Or just Either or. Cold hot. wings, so good. So good. Hot, hot, I don't hot think I've ever really had. Too. Hold yeah. on, time out. Shannon absolutely hates barbecue sauce, so we can't ever eat barbecue food or wings because the only way she'll eat a wing is if it's dry rubbed. <laughs> it's so annoying, no, so disheartening. <laughs> I have a smoker. I can't even smoke a brisket because she doesn't like it. Can't even smoke pulled pork because she doesn't like it. Is this it to tell me sucks. why you hate Shannon it's podcast? cereal, toast, or mac and cheese. <laughs> okay, I'm not a five-year-old. No. Sorry, you're six. Chicken tenders are in there. Yeah, no, tenders. okay. I like barbecue sauce, but I'm not gonna volunteer to eat it. Like I'm gonna be like, ooh, let's eat barbecue like sauce tonight. No, that's not me. Yeah, when no one there, ever wants to just eat barbecue sauce. Well, it sounds like you do. It sounds like you eat it by the spoonful. No. Dude, you're but, talking. Okay, dino you want, nuggies and barbecue sauce yeah. will eat. So wings, I like them better cold. But yeah. they are really good hot. But cold wings are really good. Yeah, day after they're always cold. I remember after my show my first show. I ordered an ungodly amount of wings. Couldn't even cl- get close to finishing them. Next morning, ate them straight for breakfast cold. Yeah. I don't think I've had cold wings. What? Like cold chicken? I don't B-dub think has, has. B-dubs has elite wings when they're cold. Especially the Asian zing cold. Ooh, I haven't had those cold. Good. I like the honey barbecue cold. Yeah. I want wings. What's the next food? Um, I don't know. What was it? French oh, fries. French fries. <laughs> okay. Talk about Go. it. I know. I'm thinking. I like French fries. Blue. Warm. Don't you dare. Warm. Warm the second day. I don't like them cold because I, I don't know. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a warm, like, kind of right when you get them, maybe a little bit, a few minutes after. Um, 
the next day they suck because they become too starchy and potatoey. Yeah. They're like very heavy. So I'm like, eh, I'm good without it. Yeah, I think wings have that sweet spot of like an hour or wings. I think fries have a sweet spot like an hour and a half after you get them. Like yeah. that's like yeah. after that, it like it gets to a point it's where like, it's yeah. too much. Unless they're like really crunchy and then they can hold up the next day. Dude, crunchy fries like Burger Suck. King. <laughs> yeah, she likes flop, floppy, I like soggy, soggy fries. fries. So basically, she can order crispy fries, soak them in water, then she'll eat them. Oh no, not gosh. soak them in water. That's gross. I just eat all his soggy fries. Yeah, I like, an, I like a nice ones. crunch to my fries. Yeah, you need no. a crunch. Burger King's fries are elite because I'm of about crunch. BK fries. I was about Wendy's fries until they switched them. Like, I like the sea like, salt fries. I, I like it where yeah, like, it you have a lot of skin. Cut. Yeah, yeah now they changed them. What are they? They're not like, I don't know what they are. I don't know yeah, what they are. Know. I forgot smoker. what they call them. But just like with the spicy nuggets, good. bring back the re- the sea cut, whatever. Sea cut. salt, French fry, natural cuts, yeah, whatever. Those ones. What? So. Spicy nuggets, sea salt, French cut fries. Just no. like the spicy nuggets, How they bring back, back oh, the sea yeah. salt, natural yeah, cut, yeah, yeah, French yeah. fries. Yeah, absolutely. All right, next, next. food. Spaghetti. Uh, let should we do? Do we want to do red sauce or like an Alfredo? The spaghetti is it's red you, sauce. It's yeah. It's you choose it. Spaghetti say say pasta sauce. if you want to do something yeah. different. Mm. So spaghetti can't is be red specific. Sauce. Spaghetti I like cold, especially with Frank's meatballs. Frank makes elite meatballs, handmade, fresh. Puts no spaghetti onion. warm, only yeah, warm. We'll not eat spaghetti warm. cold. It's just weird. No, spaghetti so. only warm. Yeah, so good. I mean, I'll eat cold pasta like a pasta salad or something like that. But That's meant spaghetti, to be I I just want it. I want it warm. I want it now. Lukewarm's fine. Hot, it's fine. But that's it. Don't yawn. <laughs> Does anyone else want to talk about spaghetti more? Or no. No. I like All it right. warm. <laughs> we'll do number five. Fried chicken. Ooh. I think. So good cold. Who's it from? KFC? No. We'll just say like a chicken shack or something. Cold. Yeah. I mean, fried chicken is really good hot, but. Cold fried chicken the next day, mm. so good. I'm mm. gonna go cold on this too because I feel like it gets soggy in the microwave if you like reheat it up. Yeah, it's yeah. just it's fried and it's just gonna. Yeah, fall I don't apart. know what about it, but it's just it's so savory and pleasing. Cold. Mm. I agree because it's it's like it's almost like a dessert, like a salty dessert. Because it's mm. cold. You guys, yeah, yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> yeah, sure. Yeah, I oh, just yeah, want a nice, crazy I want one. a warm ice cream. It's very, yeah, very, dude. A little melt to your ice cream is delicious. Oh yeah, when to you make it like extent. a soup, when you can make it like oh yeah, now it's fine. No, no, yeah. I don't. I don't. No, do that. when it's like enough to like you can stir it, not where it's like really hard. No, when it gets no? all okay. melty and it's gross. When it's a soup, I, I'm like over it. Yeah, I'm yeah, like that's, that's not ice much. cream. That's okay. soup. But being able to eat like it soup. really quick and like yeah, yeah. So. Is that it for the food we thought of? There, yeah, wasn't just there five. one more. We just did five. No. Oh, I do have one more thing. I want to talk about your addiction. Yeah. What? Yeah. To what? Cups. Why? Why do you upset my friend? Please, you guys antagonize me. You oh, send me I, cups. I you bought me a cup. Then I had to return it because I had the same cup. Oh, yeah. Bree copied my swag. Yeah. I actually brought it here today. Did you? But. She's obsessed with the Starbucks so many cups. cups. I don't know Especially why. Especially those. I don't know. They Starbucks just like knows. So like she has to have three cups for each day of the week, even though she never uses them all. Yes, I do. No, you don't. I take coffee to work. I take iced coffee to work. So I use Why don't you cups. leave some cups at work? Because I don't make iced coffee there. I make iced coffee at home. So what's the difference? So but that, then she why wants would to go I to Starbucks all the time. your cups and then you can get more. Yeah, but what if someone steals my cups at work? But then she wants Label. to buy Starbucks. So that doesn't Labeling sense. means nothing around yeah. my work. Dr. R would just eat your stuff no matter what. Everyone steals everything there. Even if you have a snack in your drawer, it's gone. <laughs> like, dang, that was in my drawer. That's Matilda, though. She's going in and stealing your crackers. No, she goes in my bag every day. She sends me Snapchats of going into my bag. What the heck? Yeah, for snacks. I'm like, bro. Get her a bird feeder. <laughs> really? <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> Honestly. But this is probably our longest episode in No, no. Shot. Yeah. No. Yeah. The energy drink review. Yeah, you guys had like over an hour, right? Or yeah, no, about forty-seven minutes or something. Uh, yeah. What okay. are we at now? Okay, this is our longest but... non-review mm. podcast. Anyway. Twenty-nine Gosh. minutes. So. All right. Well, that's kind of it for episode thirty with yeah. our first guest of Shannon. The long wife. time coming. The wife of the first lady of the. No yeah. Shot let me just go podcast. look that up. You guys well, asked yeah. me to look up so much stuff. Yeah, literally, all you're watching it on a like if you're watching it on your phone, you're on a computer at work. You can look it up and comment it. I don't it's watch it. At, I can't watch it at work anymore. Why? Because I don't have time. What? I watch it at home in bed. Mm. Mm. Well, you can still look it up then too, because you're on your phone. <laughs> so, 
by then it's too late. No. Nope. It's all, all right, it's Shane, never too you late. got to do the you get you to, get do, to the do the outro. Way. The adios. Adios. Thank right, you guys for <laughs> Thank you so much. We appreciate you guys being loyal and faithful to us. You are the best fans in the world and we couldn't do this without you. Adios, guys. We'll see you next time. It just cut off. <laughs> I don't think it got me, did it? Oh, no. We got to yeah. redo it. I don't think it got oh, me. It said movie stopped recording. Stop. Yeah. All right. The audio's still going, but now the video. Oh, wait. That means this one's off, too. Frick. All right. Redo the outro. How's it look? Oh, uh, you have to hit the red button on the front. Is it going? Red numbers in the red. Yeah. All right. We're back. Uh, nothing bad happened at all, for sure not. Nope. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Shannon, thank you for being Thanks our first guest. Thanks for having guest. me, guys. We appreciate Can't it. Can't wait to be back. Yes. If you we'll want to be back. one episode, that's it. We'll that's have to, I mean, we have four mics we... now, so like we can, we'll probably figure it out. You guys should have the squad on. That'd be a lot. Just. <laughs> yeah. A, yeah, maybe. That'd be fun. We'll, we'll think figure about it out. Yeah. We'll figure out something. That's so. a lot more cameras. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, you could just sit everybody in between. Yeah, true. Yeah. yeah. I hope Anthony sits on my lap. Nice. Nice. Probably. He said he's gonna. Did you see his comments saying he was gonna take all the airtime when yeah, he's on? Yeah, he's just gonna go off. Yeah, so, so. we'll. It, that'll be an Anthony solo podcast. Yeah, we're just gonna on. sit off yeah. to the side. We'll and just nod. We'll be like, yeah, uh-huh. smile and wave, boys, smile and wave. So, but all right, everybody, like it, comment, subscribe, whatever. Post notifications. Send the video to a friend or a homeless person. Uh, we have new episodes every Monday. Don't miss them. Yeah, the homeless people on the side of the road that say, oh, I got five kids. Help me. They got phones. I see them with their yeah, AirPods. Yeah, they're on their iPhones. True. Yeah, 100%. That's all true. That's why Thank I say you. share it with the homeless. Yeah, they're definitely right. watching. So, right. Adios, everybody. Bye, guys. Love you.